Hi everyone, welcome to today's edition of our Google Cloud Fundamentals Core Infrastructure Lab. This is where I introduce important concepts and terminologies or services for working with Google Cloud. And for today, we are exploring getting started with Cloud Marketplace. Just to do a quick intro of what Cloud Marketplace means, Google Cloud Marketplace is a created catalog of solutions. They may be commercial or open source services, but they are vetted by Google for them to be on the Cloud Marketplace. They are easy to deploy when you are ready, and it also helps to build better enterprise solution with Google services such as Kubernetes, machine learning, AI, or big data, etc. And another benefit of using the Google Cloud Marketplace is it comes with an easy to pay service because you can access different third party solutions on Google Cloud through the Google Cloud Marketplace. And all your payments are just through one particular bill and not you paying separately for these solutions, separately for another solutions. So this is why you can use Cloud Marketplace on a basic level. So let's get started. First, we start our lab. Starting this lab, we need to confirm it. After confirming this lab, the next thing I want to do is I copy the password. Then I open in an incognito window. Say I have. This is my email. Paste the password here then sign in into my GCP account. Here we are. Agree to this. Yes. So going, following the instruction, for today, we are using Cloud Marketplace to quickly deploy a LAMP stack on Compute Engine instance. And we'll be using the Bitnami LAMP stack. So the Bitnami LAMP stack provides a complete web development environment for Linux that can be launched in one click. And the LAMP stack stands for Linux, which is an operating system. The A in the LAMP stands for the Apache HTTP server, which is a web server. And the M stands for MySQL, which is a relational database. And the P stands for two things, which means the PHP, which is a web application framework, and the PHP My Admin, which is the PHP administration tools. So let's get started. Let's deploy Bitnami LAMP stack to the cloud marketplace. So the first thing we want to do is deploy LAMP stack. So back to our console from the navigation menu here, you have your marketplace. Click on marketplace. After clicking on that uh, marketplace, so you can see different third party services here on marketplace. You can explore a whole lot of them and they also they are you can also explore them from different categories that you have. So so let's go to check out the marketplace. We have Google has a whole lot of third party services and solutions on the marketplace. So we are majorly concerned with LAMP, so I'll search for LAMP. And I'll look for the lamp by Bitnami. So I keep going down. Yeah, here I am. The lamp packet by Bitnami. So I'll launch this. It's going to configure the next few APIs. So the next thing I want to do is, we am, I'm just going to keep to this name. Then the zone, yeah, let me confirm the zone allocated by this lamp. US is 4C. So let me I'll change this to US is 4C. Then I'm using this machine type, the N1, the boots, the persistent disks, and 10 gigabyte booked disk size. So you feel free, you can leave the configuration as default, the works. So the next thing is I'll accept the GCP market terms service and the Vietnamese terms of service. Then I click on deploy. So our LAMP stack is being deployed. So 
so when it's deployed it will let us know just wait for all necessary configuration and services to get finished Yes, our alarm stack has been deployed, but it contains some warning. So I suppose the warning is because we are using um, some of the configurations as a service that it's not in, that it's not yet in GA, which is general availability, probably still in beta or how far. So yeah, so the runtime configuration service is still in beta. So but maybe when you are checking yours, general availability already. So but you don't need to worry about this warning. So we we'll probably not. Um, use what need this for what we are going to do today so the next thing let's check if we've deployed this check the progress here yeah fine so our cloud marketplace has so we've deployed lamp stack on cloud marketplace so the next thing we want to do is we want to verify the, de the deployment so to verify the deployment one thing you can first do is you can check the site address of this lab so when you click on this you have the site address here so when I click on the site address you can see that we have our bitnami here you can click on get started and see all what so from here you can decide to use what you want to do with bitnami various things that you can do here but for this lab we are not doing anything just want to show you how to deploy it so the next thing we we'll go back to the GCP console. Then we need to SSH into this um, directory. So click SSH. So when you SSH, you would wait for the SSH keys to be transfer to be transferred to the virtual machine and to establish connection to the SSH server. So while that is going on, so after I've SSH into the server. I need to cd into this directory into the hops slash bitnami directory so to do that i use the code cd and both parts so here we are and you can see our bitnami here so cd into the directory as I mentioned nice we are in the directory now so thereafter php info.php script from the installation directory to a publicly accessible location under the web server document suits and to do that i'll use this command so the sudo s sh echo this is what we are copying the php and the php info and we copy it to this part under the web server so i mentioned the other time that the apache is the web server and this is the part for the apache so paste this code here then after we've copied that so the next thing we want to do is we will exit our ssh so with the exit command you would exit the ssh so how do we know if the configuration we actually copied has been deployed on bitnami so to confirm that here's what we need to do copy this code and we replace this site address with the url of the site address from this place so just go to a new win a new browser or a new tab so i'm going to replace this site address to the one from here so i just have to copy this i just need the the values here basically but yeah so let me copy the values only then press your control c so go back here and replace this with the value so it has copied more than the value so i'm just going to trim that out on both edges and, and to make sure only the value is easier and i click on enter great so here's our php version and you can see the config files of the php that, that's installed from this bitnami so php version 8.0.26 
it's probably the updated PHP that's on this and you can feel free to go through all these um, configurations files here or info files so that's all for this lab we've used cloud marketplace to launch a bitnami package for their lamp stack and lamp stand for linux apache mysql the php and the php administration service so that's all for this lab thanks for staying true you can explore more services on the cloud marketplace so there are a thousands or tens of thousands of solutions on google cloud marketplace that you can work with and i've discussed with us the benefit of cloud marketplace and what we can use in google cloud marketplace so thanks for staying true if you really enjoyed this lab smash the like button comment your thoughts in the comment section and see you in our next lab bye for now